All right, this is going to be a big episode, I feel like. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Yurikishi, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Xenoverse. Last time, after exploring a majority of Vega City, this place is big, by the way, I found the way forward to uh, this circus area. But I also obtained something that was much needed and much sought after, the Odysseum Age, which is pretty much HMO uh, 3? Surf. And now, with that in mind, with Surf in hand, it's time to explore this entire region once more and see what, uh, see what pops up. I'll see you guys in a little bit. The first stop on our, uh, the first stop on our journey back is here. Stardust Beach, which is north of Hardwarf's gym, uh, Hardwarf City. Welcome to Ride 15. Excellent, excellent, nice. What is here? Hmm. Let's see if I'm able to swim in battle at the same time. Hmm. That's a real wild goose, uh, goose chase. Hmm. What well, is up and beyond? I wonder if the uh, dowsing machine or item finder is in this game. I imagine not, but who knows. Just a lone pearl. Ooh, what's here? Hi. Edenberry? Kelpsy berry? Yeah, papa or la papa. Another Eden. And another Eden. Alright. I'll see you all back when I find the X Pokemon here. Well, would you look at that? It's an Elicate, huh? Interesting. Alright. Goodbye. I have no need for you. See you back whenever. Down here in Route 4, which is uh, to the west of Neutron City. Rock Slide! Interesting! Alright. What next? In Route 5, we can finally explore this little nook. Home Claws! Interesting. What is a p Oh. It's a Pokemon Dan. Sure. What are the rules for this area? Oh no. All right, so this has five. Oh, Lord. I'll see you back when I have found progress. All it was was a PSI update, which I can assume that it's a uh, cadaver evolve into Alakazam. Into lines, then. Get me the hell out of here. Alright, where to next? In Stiletto Town, we got... Ooh! Swords Dance! That's a good move. And... There's also something over here. Would be this. Lumberry, okay. This feels important. What the hell? The door is locked. Huh. Can't use the Pokeballs right now. Probably something post game related, I bet. That's cute. Alright, where to now? Route 6 had a rare candy. Gravity Tunnel had something I missed. What is behind this? A Moonstone. Okay. Really? 
All right. What is over here? Can I even go over here? I can. Ooh. Payback. Nice. And a cave, too. Ooh. It's a dimensional rift. You know what that means, right? And there it is. Schmirgle X. Didn't take too long, thankfully. However, it is a 1% chance of finding. So there's that. Ha! <laughs> Get fucked. Alright, get in the damn Xenoball. Nice. Badum. The Cream Wolf Pokemon. Pure fairy type. It produces a delicious low calorie cream, but it becomes rancid if not kept cool. Okay. Alright. On to the next adventure. The next stop is here at Route 12, just below Fort Belt Town, in this little cave. Blood is beyond here. Ooh. An Edenberry? Another Edenberry? And what is... An, let me guess. An Edenberry. Okay. What do they even do? Anyway, I'll see you back when I find the X Pokemon here. And there it is. Ghastly. Thunderwave. What? Alright, get in the damn ball. Oh! Interesting. You didn't immediately get caught. I said what I said, now get in the damn ball. Nice. Excuse me. Badim. Ghastly, the hard-scale Pokemon, pure dragon type. Compressed by enormous pressure, it bo its body is protected by a shell as hard as steel. Nobody knows how it looks inside the shell. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, my last party member. It's a Ghastly! For now, I'm going to be sending you to PC, because I have a Pokemon that I need to evolve first. But anyway, uh, where shall I go next? About goddamn time. Jesus Christ, this one took a while. Huh. <sighs> I hate 1% chances. Alright. Get in the damn ball. Thank you. Excuse me. Yamask, the ancient shell Pokemon, water rock type. Four times weak to grass, by the way. Its calcareous shell resembles an ancient water jar. It is unknown if men's artifacts were inspired by this Pokemon, or vice versa. <sighs> to the next location. Looks like I missed something in Sunflower Canyon. Would be this? A Thunderstone! Nice! Thunderwave is right here. And just for the sake of it, uh, this interdimensional rift has a Ponyta, and considering that you get a free one, yet yeah, no. On to the next area. So while it's not surf related, I did want to look something up. And, uh. Yeah, to be honest, I thought that was part of the wall. This crack in the wall really has a particular shape. Do you want to put the space fossils mold in? Yes, please. 
The fossil of an ancient Pokemon that lived on land. It appears to be a handprint. Do you want to take it? Yes, please. Would you look at that? Cacnea is evolving. It evolved into a cacturn. Alright, so north of Vega City's entrance, there's this little thing. Oh. It wasn't Metronal Rift, you say? Well, you know what that means. I was unsuccessful in fighting it after a few attempts and I got tired slash bored really quickly. You can find a Badoo here at 5% chance. 5%? More like 1%. Anyway. Alright, I think with all of that said and done, I may have missed a few water areas, but eh. I'm 12 minutes into the recording, and I still have my 15 minute restriction, I think, so I'm going to call it here. Next time in Pokemon's Universe, let's enjoy the circus, shall we? I'll see you guys then.